It was this a is hard pass, Kyle. Oh, this yeah. is hard pass. I'm sure. gonna give it up. Bronny James. Yes, sir. LeBron James Jr. If I'm not mistaken. Yeah, LeBron James Jr. That's a funny name. He's been drafted to the NBA. Yes, sir. Fifty fifth pick in the draft. Yes, sir. First of all, let me get your thoughts on that because he's on your <laughs> team. Yeah. <laughs> Um, the fact that LeBron, uh, Bronny James, even JJ Reddick, the new coach, which I don't know what we got, Ross Lakers <laughs> smoking that stuff. This is but, crazy. Um, yeah, it is. But the fact that all three of them said, uh, Bronny worked for it, it wasn't earned. Yeah. That's the biggest load, load of bullshit in the world. That's a fact. That's the biggest load. Of, and I'm now, 100% on the same page with you with that. Go the ahead. boy hot bus open track. <laughs> <laughs> and then on top of that. On top of that. I forgot about that. <laughs> then, then on top of that, they drafted him to play in the G League. Mm. Oh, I didn't even know that. Okay. Yeah, they drafted him to play in the G League to develop his skills. And guess what, yeah. Trav? The what? nigga hurt already. I heard. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, But, yeah, uh, we definitely drafted him because of LeBron. 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 Um, on draft night, I did uh, say I'm going to probably get his jersey because it is exciting. Yeah, yeah. No, it's uh, definitely one of those kind of situations where it's like if there is anybody in an NBA that deserves this type of thing to happen, it's LeBron. Yeah. For him to go all these years working yeah. on his body to yeah. be in the lead this long. Yeah. He it's like he put himself in a position for this to happen. Yeah, he did. And I'm glad it's happening for him. And if it was me, I would do the same thing. That's so. what's up. That's what's up. Shout out I to get LeBron. It. I get it. I, I low key hope he stay around until Bryce get get drafted. I heard people saying that. You I think like it's possible? Bryce. I like that boy Bryce. Not it is, I think it's possible, but do you think it's gonna happen? Is it about what, three more years, two more years? Two or three more years. If yeah. LeBron wanted to, he can. Yeah, that's true. Because he, in my eyes, he got at least five years left of being at least an all-star. In yeah. my eyes. Yeah. But go ahead, though. So, he came in. Mm -hmm. And in his very first summer league game, mm -hmm. he had the exact same stat line that he had in college. I saw it. But, in my opinion, well, no, because this is summer league. I don't know if you be, you don't pay attention to the group chat as much. I pay attention to the group chat. And Richard was like, uh, yeah, I just turned on the Spurs versus the Kings game. Why is the stand so empty? <laughs> <laughs> I say, Rich, that's summer league. Nobody care about yeah. that. <laughs> shout out to Richard. He was like, that's, that, that explains it. Yeah, shout out to <laughs> But, yeah, uh, he was like, oh, so the NBA and the WNBA on two totally different schedules? I was mm -hmm. like, yeah, the uh, NBA starts in, like, October. And yeah. the, the WNBA is, like, during, during the summer. Yeah. But uh, but yeah, and yeah, so that I said that uh, he had the same uh, stats that he had in college, but then I was like, wait, this is summer league though. Yeah. So it should no no, it should have been better than that. It, it should have been if he was planning to be something serious. Then I get a notification to my phone that he out. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you stupid! I was like, hold oh, on, wait a minute here now. Hey, yeah. <laughs> this is going crazy. So. I'll be honest, I like it. I like that LeBron got him there. Yeah. And I do hope the same thing. Yeah. I do hope I think that that would be super impressive if uh he's able to play with both of them, especially on the same team. Mm -hmm. My question to you is this, right? Yeah. Because I was thinking about this for a while. Go ahead. If I'm another team and I knew that the Lakers wanted Bronny. You gonna get him? I would have grabbed. Him. I would have. I, I was thinking, thinking the same say, thing. Yeah, yeah, I would have grabbed him and said, "All right, hey, y'all, <laughs> y'all got to give us um who's somebody great on the team." Uh, Austin Reeves. There you go. Y'all got to give us Austin Reeves if y'all want Brown. Yeah, that's and it. then boom, they would have had to do it if they really wanted. Yeah, the, that's that would have been that would have been crazy. That's but a fact. I thought that that was interesting, but either way, he he was the fifty uh, fifth pick in the yeah. what, second round. Yeah, it's like. For me, I'm in my mind, I'm thinking, obviously, this was a play. Like, the only person that was drafted that late and, and was good was, like, Patty Mills or somebody like mm -hmm. that. So, it's like, why why people making this? Yeah. I feel like people making it more than what it is. It's That's like, exactly what it is. Yeah, if he got drafted first round, you know, somewhere in the top ten, I could understand the complaints. But yeah. he was drafted second round. Dang, dang near the last pick. Yeah. And, and y'all complaining. Come yeah. on, man. Y'all yeah. got to be better, bro. That's I all I'm saying. Go ahead. No, nah, daggone. Um, 
the fact that he went that late, because mm-hmm. I mean, if, if I if I own a team, I'm gonna draft him yeah. in the second round just to try to get a better player from yeah, the, the for late, sure, late Lakers. For sure, so the yeah. fact that nobody else thought of that is either one or two things. Mm-hmm. Everybody in the league love LeBron or Bronny it, just not that good. I think it's I think it's the latter. And I well the first one. But I think it's um everybody in the league love LeBron and that's why they didn't go and take him because that was a clear play. Excuse me. Go ahead. Did you see the video when he got drafted, his uh, reaction? No, I didn't see it. I didn't see it. Should I pull it up? Because that, that's not copyrighted, right? It, I don't think, think it would. With the 55th pick in the 2024 NBA draft, the Los Angeles Lakers select Bronny James. Yeah. Respect, bro. Oh. That's it, there. bro. So, what in the world just happened here? They, they, everybody knew. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, Savannah tears was fake. Savannah was crying. You mm. knew he was going to the late late. No, no, no. She did this. She gave him the stuff and just. <laughs> that, that's not real. It, that's it, not real. It, Savannah's starting to act like LeBron. Oh right, bro. lord, god damn. She's starting to act like LeBron, bro. With the capping. Go ahead. I'm yeah, no. Nah, I, I ain't mean to go off you, on you. Savannah. If you pay attention to it, right? Mm-hmm. Nobody reacts like that no, when no, they no, get no. drafted. Yeah, 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 yeah. He was just sitting there, like, and then he just just put put his head head down. Yeah. He he he. I feel like he tried to fake being emotional. Yeah. Um. And yeah, so Savannah James, you know, she was doing a little. It's like, bro, we yeah. we we knew. But, but when you crying, you wipe your tears here. I don't even understand why people do that. Yeah, I, I don't know. That's when you laying down crying. Hey, you stupid. <laughs> well, yeah, man. God. So it, it's like I I, I don't think it, it felt that authentic. It, it wasn't. It wasn't. It wasn't like real. they knew it was coming. Yeah, they were just sitting like there. if I was was Bronny and and, and, and and it's the second round, fifty fifth pick, and my daddy on the team that's coming. I'm sitting there. I'm calling. Like, hey, man, they about to call my name. Yeah. I'm about to yeah. be gone. Yeah. Get yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. Poor guy, man. They knew it was coming. You got to live in your daddy's footsteps. God, dog. You ever had to live in your daddy's footsteps? My daddy wasn't there. Nah, he was there. <laughs> hey, you stupid. <laughs> oh, somebody uh, screen record that. Yeah, I was hey, hey, you stupid. Yeah, nah, I uh, never had to, though. Uh, Who was we at? I, I mean, I didn't see the reaction, but now that I've seen it, that's some BS. Yeah, it is. I don't... I, I feel a way about it. I, I don't know exactly how to describe it. Yeah. I don't know how, exactly how to put it in words, how I feel about that. But It would have been better if he exaggerated the fake. Yeah. It's <laughs> like, oh! Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And then Savannah started jumping around or something, yeah. too. She just did the little fake look. Come hey, you on, man. You know you wasn't crying. Right I'll tell you. Le- what, Shout out was to LeBron there? Yeah? I don't know. I'm not sure. So... A lot of I saw a lot of people saying that, uh, bro, this is you about to live through all of us. Uh, hoopers or non hoopers or whatever, like people that had the potential to make it but didn't make it or uh, wasn't good enough to make it but you know wanted to make it. And Bronny James is about to be in the league, and everybody is going to be hoping that he does well because he is. A regular ball player, like you go to Rose Quarter or the uh, the the pro, the Rose, yeah, the Rose Quarters, uh, the, the baseball field, so, yeah, baseball field. Take all of that out. <laughs> now I was just joking. Uh, the yeah, the projects of the baseball field uh, court, and people like Bronny James are there, and they're gonna be looking at this like. Boom. Go ahead. No, I I don't see how how how, how that coincide at all because he's not good enough and I, you know he's not good enough i know he's not and there's good a enough. lot of people that we played with that wasn't good enough that thought they was good enough so for that reason people rooting for him yeah because he's not good enough yeah that don't make no sense to me man it, it, it's 
I, I can't think of anything to compare it to for you. But though for those people, I have uh, compassion for. I understand the standpoint. I not saying that I agree with it, but I understand the standpoint. It's like I thought I was good enough, and I never got the opportunity. He got the opportunity through nepotism, so I'm hoping he goes there and does well because that will m- validate me and my feelings that I was good enough. <laughs> most of the, <laughs> most most of them people ain't good enough. Let me say that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that's the point. I. <sighs> I feel like you saying a bunch of losers happy because a loser made it and they want that loser to win. That's how it goes. I yeah. f- I, I. That That's how people felt about Drake. Drake? Yeah. How? How's that? They thought that he was a loser that he, had a nice was. voice and he made but it. Drake got a nice voice, though. There are people out there that are losers with nice voices. I... I that that that's completely different to me. <laughs> okay. I feel like the freaking league, I feel like that's the best of the best. With the music industry, that's I think everybody can agree that's not the best of the best. Can we agree on that? I, I was about to say that's my point. So oh, so it, it it it's like with the NBA, you saying that's the best of the best? Most of it. Mm-hmm. I think like 90 plus percent. 90 plus percent. But there was a person that Iverson rivaled that everybody said that that person was better than Iverson, but Iverson was the one that made it. I heard the same stories with Jordan. There was a person that rivaled Jordan, but Jordan made it, and that person Demetrius didn't. Mitchell, hook, yeah. <laughs> but those people didn't make it, and what do you what do you say to that? But those people were, a lot of people said that those people were better than the person that made it. Say so, uh, LeBron got the same story. There was a dude that was better than LeBron that didn't make it. No, no. I, I, I'm just trying to hear your stand. No, so on it. so 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 that that player, right, 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 right. I forgot Buddy's name. If I'm not mistaken, I think LeBron was like a freshman and Buddy was a sophomore, and mm-hmm. that's whenever he was better. But it's like if you better at one point. Right, LeBron eventually became better mm. at the end of, of, of the uh, day. And let me say this, mm. and I might be shoot, shoot, shooting my, my, myself in the foot, mm. but it's a fact. Yeah, hold yourself. <laughs> it's the league it, it, it is talent and not necessarily luck, but it's talent and doing the right things at the right time. Opportunity. Right, so I feel like the guy that was better than Jordan, LeBron, they ain't did the right things at the right time. That's true. You get what I I'm saying? So I feel I like agree. all of when that. The, when the scouts come out, you got to be ready. Yeah, yeah. So and, with, with that being said, yeah. I feel like the nigga wasn't better than Jordan. The guy wasn't better than, than Braun. I mean, when, you, can be a better, you can be a better player on the court, but it's just like, with Jason Tatum and Jalen Brown, most people think Jason Tatum a better player because he got that that total package. Even though the skill set is similar, Jason Tatum is a great ball player. He's great in interviews. He got a great image. He he got great this, great this, great this. Get what I'm saying? Jalen Brown, he he he's a great ball player, but he's good here, good here, good here. Mm. Get what I'm saying? So I say all of that to say. Those players that was better than LeBron and better than Jordan, they might have been better on the court for a short period of time. But as an overall collection, mm. like an NBA player, yeah, yeah, the LeBron that, and Jordan is better. The outside things matter, too. Yeah. The outside things matter, too. And, uh, yeah, Jalen Brown finally showed up. With Man, we... Than, oh, I'm sorry. All right. <laughs> God, no. All right. Hey, drop down in the comments. Let us know what y'all think about Bronny James and the NBA. Yep. Do y'all think he gonna make it? Do y'all think he just gonna, you know, show up and do what he did in college? What, what, what y'all think? Do you think he gonna he gonna uh, be a part of six man squad or he gonna be twelfth man? If I'm gonna be completely honest, the only way he would get in the game is if one team is getting blown out. That's what I heard. Um, you were saying. But yeah, I don't think he got that. Cause man, if we we talking, I I I've seen Bronny play a couple of times. Mm-hmm. I've seen his hi- highlights. He's what six? I think he listed at what six four. I don't but know. some some people say say he a six one. 
But uh, if he's listed at 6'4", if you were 6'4", your skill set is better than, than his for a fact. Yeah, I can agree. And we sitting here doing a podcast. Well, I'm 5'8". You 5'8". Your skill set is better than his yeah, right now. Yeah, I know that. But imagine if I was 6'4". That's what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? I think if you were 6'4", I still think it would have been difficult for you to make it oh, to yeah, the yeah, league. Yeah, 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 yeah. And now he up there. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah. Boy, I tell you what. Um, do you think that uh, Bronny James is better than Austin Rivers? No. No. Thank you. No. Steven Jackson, you was wrong, bro. We all been trying to tell you that. I think one-on-one, I think Bronny would beat him. I think as an NBA player, I think Austin Rivers is better. I can accept. And I say that because he's a- a- athletic and a- athleticism. In my eyes, athleticism beats talent a lot in a one-on-one game. Yeah, you know what I'm I, saying? I, I, can, I, can, I can see how that would be a standpoint. Yeah, so, I mean, for that reason, I, I think one-on-one, I think Bronny might beat him. And I say might. Yeah, I was about to say because I, I, I could see. Austin That's like Rivers. J.J. Reddick. One-on-one, I think Bronny James would kill J.J. Reddick, but on the court, J.J. Redick, a, a, a certified great NBA player. I don't think Bronny James A great is. role player, right? He's a, a, yeah. Yeah, yeah. He, he, he played in, in, in the league 10 plus years, yeah. and that's rare. I don't see Bronny doing that. His little pacemaker batteries might run out. 